Hello there and good day everybody. Welcome back to another episode of the Survival Let's Play. That's right, we are back on beta 1.11 in fact. And I'm super stoked because you know there of course there's like this crazy crash that doesn't allow people to play Minecraft on Windows 10. <laughs> such a little mess uh, but anyways if you're curious on to how I'm playing um, all you gotta do is go to update and security in your Windows settings and uh, turn on developer mode and you'll be able to play it just like me yep <laughs> so uh, thank you to um, Dallas by the way is the one that helped me I asked him how are you playing this game because I want to play it I want to play on my single play world and he told me exactly how to do it so yeah basically those are the simple steps simple as that anyways I am excited to see these campfires have been retextured and they look absolutely amazing don't they Scarlet and Dax they just seem to be loving this campfire as well um, do I have any meat or anything in here to cook for you guys I really want to see the new cooking mechanics that it has I do not but there are plenty of little animals around here there was a little rabbit up here a minute ago where's he at where has he gone to? Oh, look, there is a little piggy, and I think I have looting, so we should be able to get a couple of pork chops out of that. Oh, we did. In fact, we got three. Look, dinner for three. All right, so let's check this out. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> this is awesome. Okay, so I don't know how long that takes, but uh, we'll wait for a little bit. Yep, this is nice. This is really nice. Oh, yeah, and I did... Uh, put a hay bale underneath here. So I had that hay bale ready. I had it ready for when this fire or why do I keep wanting to say fireplace? This campfire was retextured and look at the smoke. The smoke effect is wonderful um, But I did remove the iron bars because for some reason well, I don't know why I put them but the iron bar Oh It is ready. Where's the other one? Did I pick them all up? Oh, I picked them all up <gasps> Dinner is ready guys. Okay, so one for Dax one for Scarlet and one for me, but I'm not hungry. Okay, I'll just save this for later. But yeah, this is awesome. But anyways, back, back to the iron bars. Um, for some reason, the smoke wouldn't go through the iron bars. So the smoke would stop like right here. So yeah, I had to remove the iron bars. But that's okay. I mean, it still looks really nice, right? I love it. Obviously, <laughs> the fact that we can cook on it though, that's pretty awesome. It takes about as long as a furnace would, right? So, um, on today's agenda, as you can see guys, I have a ton of um, bricks on me here because we're going to be working on a fireplace area in our beloved ravine. And I'm trying to see if there's anything over here that I could possibly need. Um, don't think I need any of this stuff actually, as we speak. Okay, so to make a campfire, you need... Okay guys, I'm going to go... Dax, Scarlet, you guys be good. You stay nice and cozy by the campfire, and I'll be back soon. <laughs> so on today's agenda, um, again, we're going to build the fireplace in the ravine. Oh, yeah, campfire. So to build a campfire, you need one coal or charcoal, I think. Um, I think both work. And then you need three sticks and three logs. Um, and I know, I think you can use strip logs as well. So if you have a ton of strip logs laying somewhere that you're not going to use because they've already been stripped there's there's your answer you can just make tons and tons of campfires <laughs> um, also I was really wanting to go out and look for berries because I want to start a little berry farm oh uh, yeah a little berry farm obviously because berries are just cool and I love berries they're so delicious um, do I have anything in here I could possibly need I always look through here oh look at all this wood I left over here let's take that and Ooh, we might need flint and steel for the campfire. Um, I think everything else can stay there. Yeah, no need for nether rack anymore for fires, which is awesome. We got the campfire now. Um, I guess you could still use this type of fire for something, but um, in this case, oh look, I can finally eat my pork chop. Okay. Anyways, I'll meet you guys over at the ravine. I should be there momentarily. Ah, and we are back, and I just remembered something. Also, the villagers, they got new clothing. They got a makeover. Oh, hello. Hello, 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 hello. Wait, wait come back. I just want to see, what are you? Oh, look at the new trading. This is great, because you can see, like, level one, level two, how much more you need to trade with them to get whatever. What is this? Um, I was hoping I could, like... Oh, you don't know what it is? Oh, it's locked, so you don't know what that is exactly. But that's awesome. You can kind of get a hint as to what you're getting. There's a lot of... Oh, what is this guy? <laughs> he looks like... He looks like a karate master or something. Oh, he's a butcher. Oh, this is awesome. Got some 
Good trades there? Okay, this is super cool. What are you? I think you're a priest. What are you? A leather worker. I want to say the tool armor, armorer. <laughs> he is the coolest one. There's one of them that have goggles. The cleric. Okay, cool. Um, but one of them has like these really cool goggles that he wears on his head, which I wish there was a way for you to get them in game. Oh, no, you don't. Get over here right now. No, you don't. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, God. <laughs> What is going on in here? What the? What is going on in here? Excuse me. What is this? Jeez. What are you guys doing in this house? First, first I built this house over a year ago. And you guys pay no attention to it. And now all of a sudden, here you are. Crowded in it. <laughs> this is funny. Okay, but I don't have a leather. I think these guys are farmers. These big hat, big hat guys right here. And what are you? Wait, come back. I just want to see what you are. You're fairly simple, aren't you? Oh, I can't click him. He's broken, I guess. Okay. Well, anyways, that's awesome. I love it. Hey, what is this door doing wide open over here? I guess they're, <laughs> they're going into every door. Okay, so, um, yeah, let's head on up. I want to check out the villager trading center because we do have some farmers up there. Uh, not farmers, but uh, villagers. And uh, I want to see... If we have any, I know we do have an armor there. As a matter of fact, I'm lost. Oh, <laughs> I forgot to put this uh, this gate up. Oh, you know what? I wanted to check something out real quick. Here we go. We got that. Let's see, is this working now? It is. Just kidding. I already knew about this actually, because I put this in here earlier. Anyways, when I logged in, um, and then this is working now, which I love this right here. Can you put brick in there? <gasps> You can put brick. And you can make any of these. Oh man, that's really gonna save on resources. That's great. Man, I wish this was implemented a long time ago, but that's awesome. That's our new stone cutter. Um, got the blast furnace here that I tested out, which is pretty awesome. This one is great for uh like iron ingots, um well not ingots, but um ores and stuff like that. It smelts it down really quickly. Very, very cool. Actually, I'll give you guys a quick little example. But it, just imagine with the new blast furnace, these, I mean, are we gonna, should we replace all of our furnaces in like all of our smelters? Like I put one here as well, just cause it just looks nice. Um, and it lights up really nice too. I think it's awesome. Let's see, I have ores in here. Oh yeah, look at that. Plenty of ores. Actually, I'll just take this stack. Let's go like so. Hello, Cypress. You're still angry, I see. <laughs> he does not like being in there. Um, I need coal. I thought I had some. I guess I left it somewhere. I don't know where I left it. No telling. There is no telling. All right, so let's just check it out. Um, blast furnace. You put that in there, and then you put your coal in there, and then yeah, like I said, it's it's quicker than a a, a, a furnace, just a regular furnace. But I mean, yeah. It's pretty it works pretty good. It works pretty good. It's not as fast. I mean, it's not as fast as I would want. I mean, I figured it should be a little bit quicker, but I mean, yeah. It's good. Um but yeah, maybe we should go and remove all of these and put blast furnace in there. It'll make that smelter super quick. Um but anyway, what else did I want to check out in here? I think that was it. This you can't use yet. Oh, the cartographer table. That's right. Let's go to the loom room. Got to go to the loom room real quick here. Hello, loom room. I guess we could have just gone. <laughs> we could have just gone through over there. <laughs> Good grief. Oh, wait, here he is. This is this is the armor. Look at the goggles on his head. I wish there was a way you could get those and wear them too. That'd be cool. Anyways, um, barrels are now usable. You can put stuff in there. Oh, yeah, here's a cartography table. This is great. I have no idea how to use it yet, but it looks really cool. <laughs> I'll have to probably YouTube or Google some stuff on how to use that because I honestly have no idea. But anyway, this is the smithing table, which doesn't work yet. The composter or the comp is a composter. Yes. I don't know if the composter works yet because this guy's standing in there, but I don't want to like kill him or anything. I think he looks cute right there. Just kind of um, standing guard. Um, and I think that's just about all of the exciting changes that I saw for this update. I mean, this is obviously not an update review, but <laughs> um, yeah, anyways, let's go ahead and move on with today's episode. So we are going to come in here and I know before I said that I wanted to leave this wall 
um, untouched because I want to be able to expand this auto brewer if we wanted to. But honestly, I don't really, I feel like maybe going all the way down might be a little bit too much. And honestly, like all the ingredients that are already here are ingredients that I use on a regular basis on the Let's Play world. Well, I guess I can't say regular basis, but I use often. And this is honestly all I need. I don't really need a whole wall full of ingredients that I'll probably never use. Like, honestly, night vision I don't use anymore. Um, so, I mean, honestly, I mean, I think we'll be okay. Look at this thing doing all good and stuff. All plentiful. Um, but anyways, yeah. Auto Brewer expansion is axed. We are not doing that. <laughs> um... So, anyways, now we have this big wall that we have lots of stuff to do with. And I'm excited because, obviously, in here we have our uh, enchant enchantment room. We have this little opening here that takes us to this wonderful melon and pumpkin farm. That takes us down into the trader villager or tra uh, villager trading hall. Uh, words are, are tough right now. Um, anyways, so right here we could have something that doesn't necessarily have to be efficient like something we have to be able to use but obviously we will make it a little bit usable uh, but i want to build a nice fireplace here and that's why i have all this brick on me because i want to make something nice and uh, just something nice and, and something beautiful to look at when you're walking through here because this is like a little open commons area right we have this over balcony here this little balcony that this one, I love this, though. It's like this nice little storage loft that I love. And so I don't want to get rid of it. So I'm definitely going to leave that there. But um, I am going to go ahead and close this off. And I'm, somehow I'm going to have to figure it out so we don't interfere with the loft. So I have to figure it out. But anyways, um, I want to build this nice chandelier since we now have the lanterns. And they are beautiful. Oh, listen to that. <laughs> New sounds. That's so cool. I love it. Okay, um, but anyways, yeah. Fireplace, chandelier, that's what we're doing today. That's what we're doing, and I'm excited to get started. So, um, first things first, I have worked on a bit of a um, design and creative mode, so I kind of um, have a hint as to what we're doing. Now, there's not really... Well, this I need to leave open. I, I'm trying to figure out, is there a better way to get into this place? So we could close this little opening off. There probably would be... We have to go through the nether wart farm. Are these retextured or... Oh, it's because of the wart. Never mind. How cool would that, though? Have, like, a tattered banner? That would be look, that would actually look really cool. Um, all right, so there we go. We have our little secret entryway into the brewer area. So we can restock and stuff like that. All right, so back to our fireplace. So let's go ahead and grab this which is our brick stairs. We're gonna go like so. And this is gonna be a four wide fireplace, but it should be fine. Is that how I wanted to do it? Yes, that's how I wanna do it. Um, okay, so this is gonna go here. I think we're gonna make this a full block. Okay, no, I don't wanna make that a full block. I got a better idea. We'll make these stairs instead. Alright, so back to our fireplace. Um, okay, so we're going to go like so. And like that. Okay, and this can go here. Full blocks would ni be nice here. There we go. Man, those are going to be uh, going like crazy, these farms. <laughs> Let's pull this out a little bit here and then put a stair here. I like whenever fireplaces kind of expand out. I think it looks really nice. And then this can go here like a so. Yeah. It's going to be a nice little fancy place, isn't it? Um, I think I'm going to put these in this direction. There we are. All right. That's looking nice. So what I'm going to do here is plans for hiding the little campfires back there so um i guess we are gonna need this to be open here so that way we can get back here uh oh mm -hmm. just a little opening here no big deal um there we go that looks oh that's gonna look so cool to have the campfires glowing back here it's gonna look awesome oops uh let's fix that 
There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and just clear all this out, actually. So I don't want this to be where you can see it. Um, there we go. And let's clear this out as well. Okay, there's the fix. There we are. Now that looks nice. That looks really nice. Um, I was thinking, though, for that part right here, we could actually use, like, some cobblestone or something. Um, that might like it, make it look a little bit better. Or maybe even some, like, some stairs. Not so much cobblestone, but maybe we could do, like, some, um... Let me see, what do I have? Even some andesite could look nice. Ooh, I like it. I think it looks good. It looks fantastic. Okay, so now let's go ahead and remove this. I am going to go ahead and replace that with brick. And now we'll need to craft up. Do I have some... Of course I don't. Uh, I have wood, but I need some of this stuff. That's gonna bother me. Gotta fill in all... Okay, so let's go ahead and craft up our campfire. So first things first, we need to make some sticks. And I'll need to make about three... Wait, oh wait, I need logs. I need logs. Um, what do I have a lot of? I have a lot of this. We'll use it. Man, we gotta go collecting some wood very soon. We are starting to run really low. I haven't, it's been a while actually since I've gone and harvested any wood. So let's make about two fires. But I want there to be a way that you could see this. That's the only problem. Um, all right, so let's see here. Let's try something else. Uh, let's make some slabs. Oh. Oh, you're noisy. <laughs> That's awesome, though. I love it. Uh, let's put the slabs here instead. Ooh, okay. I like that. Okay, so now we're going to have to make some slabs of... Oh, I actually have some already. Of this, so it's not so high. In the... There we go. I love it. I really, really like it. I think I'm going to go ahead and remove that, though. Kind of, Kind of throws everything off. Okay. Yep, it's centered. It looks great. Oh, this looks so good. So we can remove some of these torches. And where else do... Oh, you know what? These lanterns. <laughs> these sound so cool. <laughs> okay. So let's go ahead and put... I think we'll go with the andesite still. We'll do that. There we are. And then we can come over here and put our meat. And we can put our food there. And it'll still look really, really nice. So yeah. I'm okay with that. I like it. Okay. One other thing. Um, the last thing that I wanted to add to it, possibly, was our iron bars. So, I don't know if it'll even work here because, for one, I have slabs down. So, yeah, it's not going to work. Bummer. <laughs> Bummer on that. But, hey. Let's do that. There we go. Hey. Alright, we're done. We're done. I promise we are done. Um... What if we made these upside down stairs? Hmm. Very, very nice. Alright, cool. I like that design. It's different. It's bulky. It's everything that I wanted, honestly. Um, when I think cozy, I think like a big, bulky fireplace. You know, just something that looks really cozy and stuff. So, um, okay, we're good on that. Now, let's go ahead and make... I think I'm going to make this first... Or this floor here. Um... I think I'm going to go with spruce. I'm not going to do any more jungle wood. Um, so let's see here. Let's go ahead. Can we still craft wood? Here? Okay, we can still craft <laughs> regular blocks here. All right. So, almost a stack here. Um, God, I'm really going to have to figure out what I'm going to do with it as far as when we hit that loft. Like, how we're going to connect it all. That's going to be kind of the, the challenge here. Um, but hopefully we can make it, make it work. All right, let's do this. Like so. Oh, I just realized something here. This is going to be showing. Well, nothing a good carpet, good Minecraft carpet can't fix, right? <laughs> you know, after connecting this entire ceiling, um, I think that leaving it like this will be fine. All we got to do is remove this. We'll actually replace it with the oak logs, kind of like uh, the trim that we've been using throughout the entire space and I think it should be fine so one two three one two three four and five there we go except for this part right here I feel like there should be like a well 
Yeah, that's fine. We'll leave it like that. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and clear this out here. There we go. Oh, oh, uh, sorry about that, huh? Sorry, ceiling. Um, let's grab our oak wood here, fix that real quick. There we go. Okay, so. Ah, almost enough. Almost enough. I should have enough paper here, though, to make. No, I don't have paper. Um, do I have any sugar cane? No sugar cane, huh? Wait, I should have sugar cane. What is this? Ah, there it is. And if not, I have a big, like, I have not even big. I have stacks on stacks of sugar cane in our sugar cane farm because with the new beta update, I don't know what happened. I honestly don't even know. Like, I went down there to check it out and it was actually backed up. Since I've had this world, I, that was probably like the first thing I built. It has not been that plentiful. And it has been super plentiful this time around. Uh, I'm going to put this. Well, actually, no, we'll do this like that. Okay. Um, yeah, but it's been super, super plentiful. I'm looking for leather. Leather. There we are. Nice. Um, I don't know if we're going to need all of this leather, but just in case, we we'll already have it on us. All right. So let's make some books here. 19 books. Nice. And let's make some more bookshelves. There we go. All right. Boom, boom. Okay. So I, did I put one down? The, yeah, I did. Okay. So let's remove this block. Okay. Uh, there we are. Okay. Very cool. Alright, so now... You know, I wonder if I should make this all bookshelf. Should I do it? <laughs> I don't know if I should do it. That might be too much bookshelf. Uh, I don't know. I'm torn. No, we won't do it. It's just... That's way too much. <laughs> it's just way too much. Okay, so, um, as far as our shelves go, I was thinking about using, let me throw this, some of this stuff in here. I was thinking about using, um, what is that stuff called again? Oh, you know, we could put our plants right here. <gasps> we could still put our plants in somewhere. Okay, but anyways, um, I was thinking about using trap doors, but then we could also use carpet, right? Oh, I'm so sorry, Cypress. What are you doing? You're stuck there. I don't know. Um, we should have tons. I know we have so many doors. We have so many trap doors here. I cannot make any more. There's no way. There, I have so many. Let's see. Let's try the other one here. Yep. Possibly. And no. Well, I have another shulker here, but it's purple. That I think may have some wood stuff. Yeah, right here. This might be the one. And yes, I knew I had tons and tons. You know, I could use some of these too, maybe. But I know I have to, I have like tons and tons of um, trapdoors. Oh, what if I use birch? I forgot I retextured those, and they're actually really really nice. Let's give them a, let's give them a go. And kind of change it up a little bit from spruce, um, the spruce shelving that we we normally would use, uh, because you know the backdrop here is white, so or you know, birch, so. Let's try this. See what that does for us. There we go. Stripped logs. Oh, yeah. That's so much cleaner, too. It's so smooth. Let's see. We could put, like, some leaf box here. Maybe one there. Alright. I'm happy with it. I'm done messing with that. <laughs> so, there we go. We have this funky little animal rug in here. Very large animal, indeed. But, uh, there we go. Alright guys, well I'm happy with that. Hopefully you guys like it as well. Um, I've been having a lot of fun with this update. And honestly what I wanted to do besides, I mean I know I, I built this. This kind of like consisted of the entire episode. But it was really about using the new tools. Like using the stone cutter. Using uh, the blast furnace. And uh, using some of the other new text, the new things like, uh, what else am I using? <laughs> the campfire. I mean it's just, it was more about that honestly. But, um, I think next episode we are going to do something maybe a, t a teeny tiny bit more technical, but not so much more. It's going to be buildy again. Um, as always, you know, that's what this, this whole series is about is building and just having a good time. 
Um, but I want to do some more stuff in Tent City. So we're going to head out to Tent City next episode because that place is just, I love it over there. It's so like wilderness-like and uh, Scarlet and Dax are out there waiting for us. So we're going to get out there next episode, do some buildy stuff over there. So stay tuned for that. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it. Thank you again so much for watching. I love you all and I'll see you next time. Bye!